Okay, so now I'm just going to look at the um, first way that users can curate content within the site. Um, at the moment, this is the content that we've got in the site. Um, we will be adding features in the future to allow users to add and curate their own content, but for the time being, we'll focus on our content. So you've got two ways of finding this. In the front navigation, in the dashboard, we've got um, a favourites area here which gives us a quick snapshot of the favourites that um, I've added. Um, we also have a favourites uh, navigation on the left-hand side here. So clicking either of those takes you to the same page, um, which is a list of the content that you've favourited. Um, gives you a quick idea of what type of content it is, whether it's an article or a drill. Um, and we can manage our favourites quite easily here, so we can remove stuff um, doesn't take it away from the page, gives you the opportunity to undo it in case you've made a mistake, but we can start to manage our favourites here. So how we actually add stuff to favourites is really straightforward. Um, any piece of content that we go into, um, so whether it's a guide or it's a drill, has on the side of it um, an option to add to favourites. So if I add that to favourites, then that drill is going to appear in my um, in my favorites uh, let's scroll back if I add same with this piece of, with this article this guide add that to my favorites um, and it updates on the article itself by telling you that there's um, information there that's gone into my favorites folder um, go back into my training ground <coughs> and um, let's look at a, a full session as well because this is quite quite cool because we can also now add uh, complete sessions into the favorites which is um, something new so add that to my favorites and then it's going to add it in there so when I go then back to my locker and um, open up my locker whilst it loads I can go into my favorites and all of the stuff that I've added in there um, is, is now there as a favourite, so the session, the content, um, the, the drill that I've just added in all appears now in my sessions, in my favourites. So when I go from my favourites to, um, to sort of look at the article, I can just click on it from within the favourites folder, it takes me straight to the piece of content that I favourited. If I click back, it'll take me back into my favourites folder. So this is just a really nice and easy way for people to save articles that they may be halfway through reading. Um, and it's also a really easy way for users to save their favorite content. So things that they really like using, whether it's a favorite um, session, it's a favorite drill um, to, pro to sort of help you navigate the content in the future. You can just stick it all into your favorites folder and um, come and find it at any time. The next thing that we'll look at is actually folders. So um, it's the, the next sort of important part of, um, of looking at, at, at how we can um, curate content. We'll leave sessions for now, but we'll look at folders next. Thank you for listening.